designing of a learning system in the previous class we have understood how the play checkers game and uh, uh, choosing the training experience of it and now in this case we will be understanding how to choose the target function choosing the target function assume that the playing checkers uh, checkers game which is which is already have all the database of all legal moves now the program needs to learn how to choose the best moves among these legal moves so it has the database of legal moves and the aim of it is to choose the best move among these legal moves priori legal priori stands for a legal moves that define the last piece or the best result at a long stretch is called priori many optimization problem lie in this category by exact sequence of moves which gives the best result which is not available choosing the best target function a target function means a function that chooses the best move for any given board state is called target function there are two types of target function discussed here one is choose move and evolution function choose move is represented as a target function choose move b to m b stands for board and m stands for a move which is legal move this accepts as an input of the board from the set of legal board states b and produces the output of some move from the set of legal move m so this is the board b and the move is chosen and this is choose move now the drawback of a choose move the choose move target function will turn out to be very difficult to learn when indirect training experience is available in the system indirect training is the training which is played and recorded so that is indirect training so there is a problem when the choose move is chosen as a target function now the next one is evolution ev ev evaluation target function assign assign a numerical score to any given board state target function v and the notation v b to r where b is a board r is the better results that is the uh, real value so v uh, v maps to any legal board state v maps to any legal board state from the set of b to some real value so this is the b board state and r is the real value if r is higher there is a better result now the target function v used to select the best move from any current board position example the target value v of b for arbitrary board state b is b if b is a final board state that is 1 then v of b equals 100 if b is a final board state b for that is lost when v of b equals minus 100 if b is a final board state that is drawn then v of b is 0 if b is in the final is not in the final state in the game then v of b equals v of b dash where b dash is the best final board state that can be achieved from b and playing the optimal optimally until the end of the game so b dash is the best final board state that can be achieved from b and playing optimally until the end of the game now again there is a drawback of v of b what is the drawback of v of b it is not efficiently computable it is not efficiently computable because this does not give the exact real time solution hence it is non operational definition the solution in this case is operational description v so the solution is the operational description v which helps the checkers playing from program 
to select the best moves within the realistic time bounds. So, operational description V is a solution for not efficiently computable and which gives the best moves within the realistic time bounds. And it is represented as operational description of ideal function V. Hence, the learning algorithms uses approximation to the function called function approximation. So, the problem was V of B was not efficiently computable and it is represented non-operational definition and the solution was operational de description V which gave the realistic time bounds moves and it is represented as operational description of ideal function V. Hence, the learning algorithm uses approximation to the function called function approximation. Now, it is from ideal function V to function approximation. And this function approximation is represented as V bar or V power. Now, so this is the tar target function representation. Evolution function showed what is the non-operational non definition, then what is operational definition, how target function V is changed to target function approximation. Thank you.